Hey y'all, we're here at the layover. It's your girl Desiree with my girl, Natasha. <laughs> and we're here to serve you piping hot tea. I mean, it's just, it's crazy. I don't the price. I don't know if Cupid took a vacation. What is right. going on? Who even knows? I don't understand it. Right. So I know y'all on social media, left and right, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, all of that. There are a lot of celebrity divorces going on. And the first one, the main one, they're not really talking about it, but we know what's going on. Uh, Carmelo Anthony and Lala. What you think about that? You know what? It hurts my heart, Natasha. I honestly think they're pound sign goals. <laughs> they are, I thought, what was Black Love, New York version. Uh -huh. So it's just crazy to me. Honestly, I think hell has frozen over. Ooh, that's deep. Mm -hmm. That's deep. Well, you know, she's the one that filed for um, the separation oh, for the she? divorce. Yes, she did. And, of course, social media is always talking, and a lot of people are saying that um, it's a stripper, allegedly, that kind of wedged the gap in between them two. Yeah, did you hear about that? I heard that. I heard that. But here's the thing. I'm hearing two sides of the story. Right. I'm hearing she's a stripper and I'm hearing she has a master's degree. That right. don't mean you can't be both though. Exactly. But you still breaking up a home. That's the bottom line of it. So allegedly that's what you're doing. So I mean I don't understand that part of it. But then Carmelo had the nerve to say that when he's away on games, his excuse to justify if he is cheating is that um I'm not the one that married that's married, she is. You know what? I'm not, you know, not going to sit here and pretend like I haven't heard rumors about Melo for a long time. They they kind of have the <coughs> Will Smith, Jada Pinkett Smith type oh, thing going on. No, like, you know what? That's all allegedly. Right. So I'm not saying that you did not hear that from the layover. All I'm saying, but not really saying, is <laughs> I honestly think celeb marriages at this point are a complete sham. That's how I'm feeling. Right. I mean, speaking of New York, look at our girl Mary. Yeah, Mary J. Blige is really going through it. A lot of people didn't know she was married. I'm like, y'all didn't know about Kenny. Yeah, well, you know, technical difficulties that happened. <laughs> but yeah. Know. But can do. I, that's her ex, or soon to be ex. Right. And it's gotten so ugly. And it I'm is. just like, it if, it, if Mary J. Well, first of all, the, the Fire album that is awaiting this is I can't wait because I know Mary's about to put her soul into it and that uh -huh. next album is about to be lit. But it's just like, what? Who stays together? I know, I know. At and least he, in Hollywood. That's true. And he's very, very messy with it. He pretty much was saying that uh, he was writing off traveling expenses, $420,000. He said it was traveling expenses. But Mary J. Blige is saying that, no, that's you tripping off on your little side girl. So, ain't no way you, you claim it. You a side girl. That don't even sound oh, right. But listen, the girl is, um, she's Mary J. Blige, former protege. So, uh, her name is Star Shell. Oh my goodness. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, apparently that's where all the money is going. To Star Shell. <laughs> okay, so is this a, like, what, what, what is going on? And then, and then here in Atlanta, yep. you have Tiny and T.I. Exactly. And I'm thinking, okay, they weren't really black love goals, but they kind of were just because they were like the ghetto Huxtable. Uh, they had that coffee thing going on. Yeah, I definitely like their relationship together, but a lot of people are speculating that for them, it might be a publicity stunt for their last and final season of so. The Family Hustle. Because then, then it's like, all of these celebrities, they're going with these strippers, and you said Ken Do was with the, pro the protege, and right. T.I. is with Bernice, allegedly. And I'm just like, what? You cannot date an Instagram model or a side piece and not expect this to come out when you are that famous. It does not make sense. Right, yeah, I don't understand it either, but I just hope that moving forward that this is a sign for everyone famous and non-famous to just really, really, really just make sure that it's true and honest and real love. Because I'm telling you this much, when it's that time for me, it look. That's how I feel. We but gonna hold each other but down. what really blows me is you say, okay, well, Hollywood is all for shams and this and that. Yeah. But then Jesse Williams. That was Woke Bay. That's Woke Bay. That's <laughs> Woke Bay. And he is allegedly divorcing his wife. Right. After he didn't gave a speech at the BET Awards about how black men and black women and this and that. And yeah, now he's dating Minka Kelly. And I'm just right. like, I, 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 I'm about to tap out of the yeah. dating game. And I'm not even a celebrity. I know. It's, it's definitely. <laughs> you and me both look. Where is the wine? I don't know. <laughs> it's messy and it, get, it makes my head hurt. Yeah, for real. <laughs> for real. So listen, that's what we have for y'all today as far as the celebrity gossip, celebrity news, 
hide your kids, hide your wife, all the divorcing is going on today. And I do want to thank you for tuning in to the layover, the first stop before your main stop, your place to take a break and get a dose of celebrity news and entertainment gossip. Until the next layover, peace. peace.